Hi, this is Jim Shulman with Home Barista. Welcome to The Bench. We are now on our third video of the Bezerra Strega, and uh, this video is about making shots and tune making different sorts of shots. Uh, the dream of a lever machine is that you can play it like an instrument, as if you're playing a fiddle or a piano or something. And um, I suppose the more modern hydros and slayers, the variable pressure machine, are similar to that. Um, now, with the Strega, Bezerra has taken this one step further by melding a lever group with a pump. This allows you a very wide variety of things you can do, and we will demonstrate those now. Um, for the first go-round, I'm going to make a shot that probably won't taste very good at all, because I'm going to do every single possible thing you can do with this lever. And that's probably way too much. Um, one of the things that happens as this lever fills is that air gets trapped inside at the top and this air compresses. Now, if this were a machine fed by boiler water at one bar, the air would compress to about 50% and you would have about half as much, half the water in the cylinder. 50% air, 50% water. If you're under line pressure at three bar, then you'd be pushing that air up all the way to one quarter and the, lever would, and the cylinder would be three quarters full. But with a nine bar pump, you're pushing the air up all the way to 90 to 10% and the cylinder is 90% full, which means that when you add even if you don't use the pump to make the shot, you've loaded a lot of extra water into this cylinder. Um, and that seems to give it more punch, and you need a finer grind or a larger dose. The longer you, the higher you build up the pressure in the pre infuse. I'm going to demonstrate some of this with this shot. First, I need to flush the glue. And we're good. pull down the lever and I'm going to mirror a commercial lever shot with a three bar line. And that is by running at seven, about seven seconds. One, one mosquito, two mosquito, three mosquito, four mosquito, five mosquito, six mosquito, seven mosquito. And now we're pre-infusing the pockets at a roughly three bar, but I'm not making the shot. I have a lever I've turned off the pump, but the lever is not doing anything. Now suppose I want to imitate a pre-infusion on a LM machine or a commercial pump machine. Then I can bring the lever back down and start the shot with the pump. That's what I'm doing now. And now suppose we have a hydro and we want to do variable pressure. We can do that. You can start with a really slow flow and then go with a very high flow and then slow it down again. And then bring it up again. And then slow it down again. As you see, the sorts of things you can do are endless. Probably most of them are fairly useless. Uh, I'm sure this is not going to be the, the greatest shot of all time, but as you see, the sheer variety of things you can do is unmatched by anything on the market. This is a Carmen Belota, which is a little darker than I like, and we'll see if it's at all palatable. Well. It's a nice shot. I would love it at a cafe. It's extremely sweet, given all this crazy uh, over-extraction I've been doing. 
It's got a bitter edge. It's very heavy bodied. It's actually a lot like an LM shot with that three bar pre-infuse followed by the pump might be just a trick to get a muscular shot. But it's pretty ordinary. I mean, um, all that all that pedaling on the lever probably didn't do the taste much good. Okay, I need to knock out this puck. And in this case, I'm going to knock out the entire basket. And I'm going to flush the group. I'm going to give it a brush. And now we're going to do a second shot. As you see here, one of the questions people have asked about the Strega is if it's possible at all to do a classic home lever shot. The Electra Micro Casa is a spring lever that has exceptional clarity and purity, uh, not much body. And that is a machine, and we're going to try to emulate the shot that is like the Electra. What we have here is a Kinya Kirinyago, that's very light. And we need to flush the glue. And since the Electra is a one bar machine, we're going to count to six. One mosquito, two mosquito, three mosquito, four mosquito, five mosquito, six mosquito, and we're roughly at one bar. And we wait another four seconds. Four. And now we finish the pre infusion. And we can let the lever up. And we may have, here we go. I gave it a pump grind. I should have given it a slightly coarser grind. But as you see, we are still getting ourselves a nice shot. And now I need to retard it a little bit. For these electrolyte shots, I just I don't want much of a flow. I want the barest dribble. As you saw, the lever went halfway up because the cylinder was only half full at one bar. caramels and sugars extracted as you would using more of the pump. So the taste is clearer, but it's also drier. This is a shot for people who like a, who actually like quinias, which are dry, not supposed to be sweet. Uh, you can sweeten it up on this machine, but still. Anyway, thank you for listening. And I hope you found this interesting.